Mini Wargamer Dave here from MiniWarGaming.com. Okay, my man, what's your name? Yammer Brandenburg. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. So what army we got here? We have the Black River Pirates, which is a modified Vampire Counts army. It's a Warhammer army. It's a 2,000 point army. It was running at Grand Tournament this year as well. It's customized uh, with the Vargulf being one of the main customizations and the Black Knights being the rest of the main customizations. Excellent. How long did it take you to make? To paint? To come up with in your mind, conceptualize everything. How long did it take you for this army? It took me about four months for everything. Uh, getting all the pieces together was before the four months, but after that, putting the individual pieces together, it took me the longest on the Black Knights because they're heavily customized because they're seahorses instead of regular horses. Uh, the banner, for example, on the standard bearer is actually two banners from Epidemus model. And the White Lord, who usually has a sword with him, actually has a uh, Vampire Counts banner with an Ogre banner over it. Very nice. You know how sometimes you look at armies and you're like, that's a gorgeous looking army? That'd be inappropriate for this, because it's awesome looking, but you would say something like, wow, that's menacing looking. Well, I'm hoping it's menacing looking because it's evil. <laughs> it's supposed to be an evil army and I painted it with a dark theme to it, giving it the Black River Pirates because if you look in the book, there is an actual Black River on the map. So at this point, the Black River Pirates came to birth and I just had to put the models together for it. Very nice. And the boat? The boat is handmade. It's uh, an MDF force base, I should say, with uh, balsa wood over top with sepia painted on it. That's it, eh? That's it. And a little bit of spray coat. A little bit of spray coat. Yeah. Each uh -huh. of the bases on the models are also the same. They're actually... The uh, modular trays have been cut up so that the individual pieces can have the wood on them. Cut, separated. You can see even some of the lines and where the model pieces are together. And um, it's all modeled modeled very beautifully. Thank you. I must say. That's cool. Well, good luck. Thank you. Make sure you vote. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I guess I could vote. Yep. Yeah. You know, in situations like these, uh, kind of scenario comes to mind of a police cruiser pulling over a, you know, speeder, and, uh, well, there would, there would be an amount involved in this. Yeah, something you know, like this. Some, some kind of contribution to the police fund. Perhaps a contribution to the police fund. Yeah, well, yeah. in a case like that, you would need to know how much would be adequate for a, a contribution. Right, yes. right. The adequate contribution. Yes, for yeah. you and everybody involved. Right, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Just in case a cameraman were nearby and wanted also to, you know, make Ex sure that exactly. Yeah. 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 But that's just wrong. But it's fun and it's profitable. Just because it's wrong doesn't mean it's not wrong. Yes. But it's an evil army. It is an evil army. Can I give you this? You know what? You're just going to have to. Uh... Oh, I'll go right. One more vote for the army. I feel so dirty. <laughs>